into the project is a Newton's cooling law problem. And so the equation is going to be temperature equals temperature ambient plus temperature object minus temperature ambient uh, E raised to the negative KT. So the T ambient is going to be 70 and the T object, the first initial body was found at 80 degrees and you do the minus T ambient which was 70 and the E and you're looking for K and the T is going to be 1 because the initial was 80 and that equals 75 was the first body found from. So you're going to subtract the 70 and you get 5 equals 10 E K 1, so negative K. And then you're going to subtract the 10 out and you get 0.5 equals E negative K 1. To get the E out of the way, you're going to do your natural log. So natural log 0.5 equals negative T negative K1. And when you do this, you're going to get a negative 0.693 equals negative K1. And you're just going to subtract out the negative 1 and you get just a positive 693 equals K. Okay, and then from there, you're going to... You're going to go ahead and you're going to use a K and you're going to add in a normal human temperature, which is 98.6. So you're going to put the 80 over here. Then you're going to put the initial, the, I mean, that's the room temperature, the 70 plus the 98.6 minus 70. Uh, e raised to the negative 693 times T, because we're looking for the time now at which the body was initially when Mr. Fries was dead. And so from here you're going to do 80 minus 70, which is 10, equals the 98.6 minus 70 is 28.6. And that's going to be E, and the E is raised to the negative 6.693 times T. From here, you're going to divide out the 28.6, and from there, you get 0.393496.5. Don't want to cut it off too early, so it doesn't come out weird. Then you're going to do the E. Raised to the, of course, the negative 6.693t. And you find the natural log to cancel out the E. And from here, the natural log of 0.34965 is negative 1.516. Um, that's the basis of it. Equals negative 0.693t. You're going to divide out the 6.93t, and when you do that, you get 1.516 equals t. And this is going to be an hour, so it's going to be like an hour and 30 minutes. So when you do that, and the body was initially found at 6 o'clock, so you're going to go from 6 o'clock minus an hour and 30 you come out with 4.30. So the body was initially dead at 4.30 p.m. And that's how you figure out the problem.